You need to keep her? No, no, no. Well, we're going to send her home. Okay. Um, get some antibiotics. My, my technician will put them in my pocket. I'll explain that in a second. But anyway, this beautiful baby here, if you're able to see, has a very, very large dilatated colon area. I mean, look how nice and thin and spelt all that part of her is. And you get down to her butt and you go, whoa, where'd that ghetto come from? <laughs> he was away at MSU and I didn't even notice it. And uh, he said he noticed it before, but he thought it, she would have passed it, whatever. But he yeah. got to have what happens is the back, the, the body is responding to the bacteria, which makes all the mucous membranes in there get swollen and thick, which makes her whole butt get swollen. And then, not to mention that, but sometimes the nerve toxins that are being produced by these bacteria, okay, will also cause, you know, a constipation or the, the intestines not to move so easily. But anyway, the first half looks perfectly normal, no problems, but the back half needs a little bit of help. So anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to start some antibiotics. Um, teach mom how to use those, and hopefully we'll get a completely healthy snake in the next week or so. Is All it right. dangerous for us? To